What's up guys, Heeking here bringing you another live reaction to this month's Attack on Titan. Chapter, I believe, 119, which is also the start of volume 30. Now, as you all guys know, season 3 of the anime has ended and it's been confirmed that season 4, which is also the final season, will air next year in 2020. Which also means that the manga will be ending around then and my theory of course or by my calculations is I imagine we have only three volumes to basically 12 chapters left maybe if you know if he goes for a short round maybe eight but I think 12 because there's a lot of stuff he needs to wrap up I think so 12 I think would be enough to do that plus Isayama has stated before in the past that he likes to aim for four to five volumes and recently all of his arcs uh, have been five volumes long so I you know I am 100% uh, uh, you know, what's the saying? Positive that it will be at least 12 more chapters left. Well, with this chapter, 11. So, yeah, the series should be ending in June 2020. And the anime would be airing sometime after that, I imagine. Anyway, uh, the bad news for that is we don't know if which studios is going to animate it. Uh, there's been rumours that they're actually, that season 3 was their last season and that the project or the anime is going to go over to someone else hopefully that is not the case but you know we'll have to wait and see anyway guys let's get on with reading the uh, translation for 19 uh, for 119 and uh, get to it so here we go uh, uh, first page so we left off with uh, Zeke getting shot down by the car titan and Aaron getting injured as well so things are looking very, very bad, and it looks like Zeke might end up, you know, doing his little roar and transforming all the people who drank the, uh, the spinal fluid wired in the Titan. So yeah, it looks like we're going to get to that point. Anyway, we're starting off, and we're at the wall that Eren sealed off with his tight, hardening Titan, and the Beast Titan is right behind that. Smoke coming from the nape. Broad, uh, uh, Galarad, Galarad, don't let the Beast Titan, and the, don't let the Beast and the Founding come into contact. So now we're cut into a shot of Reyna behind some buildings and some soldiers, the Marlene soldiers pointing. If they use the found, if they use the founding power, it's the end. Eat the founder before that happens. So they're giving Reyna some orders to, you know, get his ass moving. And Aaron's like, oh, finally, Aaron, stop it already. And now we're cutting to the next page. Uh, chapter 119, Big Brothers and Little Brothers. Oh, so I imagine this is to do with Aaron and Zeke and uh, Falcom and Colt. A lot of symbolism there, basically. And I imagine also to do with uh, Pokemon and Mar 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 Marcel. Marcel was it? So let's see. So Aaron's rushing off. Uh, obviously he's got bullet wounds in there. Uh, the one who should be carrying that power. The least in the world, Aaron. That's you. So that's Reina's thoughts. And Aaron, uh, he's just, he stopped at his tracks seeing Zeke on the floor. And Aaron seems very concerned. And the jaw titan has just come out and bit him. He's grabbed him on the, on, on the fire. And he's biting him into the knee biting down and Aaron's raising his you know armored you know armored fists and he brings it down on Goliad's nape uh, and it, it looks like he's crushed at least a bit of uh, Poll Pollock's uh, face off so yeah you can see the damage there and there's is that is that Aaron is screaming Goliad and and Aaron is just smashing it down and then he gets shot the bullet's gone through through the army and into his head and we're now cut into a shot of Peckham's the car titan with that big ass cannon on her back still on the wall aiming we hit the founding he stopped moving McGough okay he's uh yeah all right another blow to the beast but before he can before they can aim you've got the uh Jaegerists appearing from behind and going for the kill oh Peckham's just oh how annoying as if the as if they're pests. So Cart Titan's moving around and she uses the power of the gun to, to smack one of the uh, survey calls or the Jaegerists into, into, into it basically. Don't let, and there's, I think that's a, that's a flock, don't let them shoot, yeah. So they're trying to distract them and now we're cutting to who I'm at, yeah, we're cutting to who I imagine is Armin, he's on the rooftop. It's the Cart Titan. We need to do something about it first and there's Mikasa coming in. Armin, she's pushing him down. And bullets just go right past his head into the building. So inches from death there, Mikasa just saved his life. Shit is getting intense and we're seeing where the bullets came from. 
a bunch of Malian soldiers firing from the from an open window in a building. They're preparing to shoot, and then they just got shot. They just got shot by Connie with the uh, thunder spear. They just got blown up. So nice, nice there. Uh, good riddance, I'd say. We can't pass from here either. Let's retreat. It's full of enemies inside the houses as well. So yeah, we've got a. Uh, we got Mikasa, Armin, Connie, and uh, I think that's Jean there from behind, yeah, coming in. And Mikasa is now turning to Armin. We have to take care of Marlene's army first, yeah, because these guys are just, yes, and Armin's agreeing. And he's noticing something. Oh, uh, there's Pixas on a horse, and he's with the other soldiers. Get around them. Let's catch the enemy soldiers from behind. Pixas there leading the charge. He's got a sniper rifle. They all got snipers, it looks like it. Armin's like, no, this is not the, the time to fight Marlene's army from the front. It's exactly as Commander Pixar says. Let's circle around the enemy's back, right? So it looks like they're gonna avoid a frontal assault and try and sneak around and get them from behind, like a pincer move, basically. And now we're cut into a Neil Nile, is it? And he, he's still behind that building with some other soldiers. And the survey calls are jumping, and there's the Marlins firing at them. Now up to a panel of uh, Pixar's leading the charge on the horses, and now to a panel of uh, Yelena just looking looking somewhat down and now to a panel of Zeke where half his body's just been blown off that bullet basically went through his uh, arm and basically ripped off the entire back to bottom like so it's kind of weird to explain imagine imagine uh, it's like that like that's the hole like that's his body there and that's his legs here and that's just that that's what it is and that's the stomach basically the stomach area and the crotch area that's all and all this part is just gone from the ass to the torso like just a big curved hole like it's nasty man but Zeke is obviously still alive I've fallen to the ground was I shot and in the background in the background we've got uh, Aaron on the ground and uh, Reyna on top of him Galliard onto the side there falling down and Zeke uh, Reyna's on top of uh, Aaron and trying to beat him down Aaron wake up Porco Aaron is screaming wake up we're almost done muster up your strength He's trying to save uh, Porik now. Oh, as he's touching him, something's happening. As he's touching him, it seems the paths are doing their little. Whizz. Yeah, because because Reyna, Reyna is touching Aaron, and now and now and and, and he's also now touching uh, with his fingertips. He's slightly touched Porco, I think, and it it, it it unlocks the paths or whatever. Reyna, I'm sorry. So we're getting flashbacks now. There's Reyna, Bertold, and young Annie, and it looks like we're seeing the point of view of uh, uh, Marcel. The truth is, even though you weren't supposed to be chosen as a warrior, I, by pr by praising you and talking poorly about my little brother, I have manipulated the army's impressions of you. I wanted to protect my little brother. Oh, Paul can see all of this. He's seen his brother's memories. Zeke's getting up. He's getting up. Aaron sees this. So you are, and McGuff is still up there. He's he's using the red nine. Oh, the beautiful red nine. I love that gun. Resident Evil fans, anyone? Resident Evil 4 fans? <laughs> so uh, uh, the car titan's busy swatting at the uh, Jaegerist and McGough is out there reloading his little weapon so you're still alive. And Pickup sees a Zeke. And now we're kind to Zeke, Aaron. Now I'll call the titans. Oh, he's getting ready to shout and Aaron's just like... I think it's Aaron going like, wait. Yeah, he, he does... Oh, I don't, Aaron, doesn't, Aaron doesn't want him to do that. Shit, and Reyna sees this as well. Please wait, who's shouting? They, in this place, Falcom, he, he has accidentally ingest, ingested your spinal fluid. Don't scream. Zeke sees this. Aaron sees this. What? Reyna sees this. What? You know it, right, Mr. Zeke? I took the right of succession to the beast so that my family won't be sent to he he heaven. Brother, and then Falcom's just like, brother, let go of me. To, and this is cold. He's trying to, oh, he's trying to speak to Zeke about this. He's trying to, like, get to his heart here to be honest before you betrayed us i never understood what you were what you were thinking at all never but i don't think you'd be the type of person that would allow children to be involved so easily i don't mean to tell you to just keep silent like that and die i only want you to wait until falcon gets out of the range for the screen to be effective after that you're free to kill each other as much as you like the Malians and the Eldians can kill each other all they want, but please don't involve my little brother. Oh, poor Colt, man. And there's Gabby on a horse riding in. Falcon, quick, get on the horse. Don't come close, Gabby. Zeke, Zeke's just... 
Oh, he doesn't want to. I don't. He doesn't want to do this. Like he's broken hearted about this. But Colt, this your feelings toward your little brother. I understand them well, Mr. Zeke. That's why it's a pity. Oh God, the horror on Falcon and Colt's face as they realize what he's about to do. And Gabby's just rushing towards the two. Like and Zeke's just screaming now. And there's Falcon and Colt holding Falcon's hand. And he's screaming, Gabby's reaching out, and oh man, Colt is grabbing Falcom. It's okay, Falcom, your big brother st will stay with you always. Let go, big bro. Falcom looks at Gabby. He's reaching out to Gabby, and for Colt's closing his eyes, and he's hugging his brother tight. And there's Neo, oh crap, and oh crap, and there's Neo, and there's that four-eyed prick, and there's Pixis having a final drink as they've just gone into position to fire, and he... And Pixas, I think it's Pixas, he's closing his eyes as he realizes what's happening and... Shit, we're getting this. We're getting this big view. Like this landscape view of all the people that have dragged in the fluid transforming now on all sides of the, of, of the town. And uh, further down. Jesus, man, this is going to be an amazing shot in the anime when they get to it. And there's the Marlian soldiers unaffected watching. There's Armin and Amikasa looking back, Connie and Jean. And there's just smoke rising, and you can see the silhouettes of all the titans now rising up. Shit has gone. Shit has gone bad. What is it? The enemies have turned into titans. I'm going to bring the titan rifles. And there are all the Malian soldiers are looking ahead, and boom. There's the titans now racing towards them. I cannot tell which one is Pixis or Neil, but yeah. Jesus, man. Jesus. I'm gonna pause it here. And we're back again, and yeah, uh, uh, I, I, I guess rest in peace to ne 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 Neil and uh, Pixis, man. Uh, I'm assuming this Titan, the little Titan in the middle of the panel here, it might be Pixis because he looks like he's got a mustache or something, but uh, I don't know. The, the, the Malian soldiers are getting overwhelmed as all those Titans are rushing at them. And there's Raynor seeing the damage, he's the look of horror and oh god, oh god, there's Falcom. There's Falcom transferred and Jesus Christ, his Titan looks freaky. What the fuck kind of Titan is that? Holy crap, that's the stuff of nightmares, man. Uh, Falcom looks weird, he looks like a chicken. His mouth looks like a chicken, like, like it's like a freaking beak with teeth, like... Like, it's it, like a fish or so. It's weird. And he's got like a long neck and shit. And, oh, that's freaky. And, uh, Colt is dead. He got caught in the, uh, transformation in it. So he would have incinerated. He would have been incinerated. Shit. And there's, uh, Zeke. Do it, Falco. Kill Raider. And he's ordering. He's, or he's ordering Falco because he can control the Titans. And he's ordering Falco to go and kill Raider now. Oh. Raider's getting overwhelmed, he's trying to push him back, and Fa Falcom is huge for his size, damn. And there's Gabby on the front, uh, Colt, oh, she sees, she sees Colt burning, yeah. His rifle is under him, and there's Colt, and he's, he's pretty, he's made, he pretty much looks like Armin when he got incinerated by the Colossal Titan. Uh, Falco, and Gabby's crying now, she looks back, and there's Falco on the ground. And there's Raynor on top of Eren and Falco. Like he's got his hand on uh, Eren's face and he's got his other hand on Falcon's throat trying to keep him down. Going up against three Titans is impossible. Eren will most likely escape to be beheaded by Falco. I Eren's just kicked him away. Raynor's going backwards. He, may, he, he grabs Eren's legs and he pushes him down. And there's Falco biting into uh, Raynor's uh, nape. Falco, my nape. And Zeke's just gotten shot again through the through the neck or the head. Shit, man. Ah, Raina and uh, uh, Aaron looking up, and there's like the Z Zagris. Yeah, they've just got defeated now. And one of them, I think it's Flock. He's the only one I think who's still alive, and he's taking cover behind the uh, the below part of the wall. Shit. Anyone? Is everyone dead? And there's the snipers. I think that's McGuff aiming or, or one of the soldiers inside the tank. Uh, this time I will bring him down without a doubt. I think it's McGuff and there's Peckham's, they're aiming. And there's uh, Zeke's body just like, his tight body just like, full of like two big ass bullet holes. For now the danger is gone. What's left is only the founding. Re recharge complete, so I think they've just reloaded. Uh, you don't need your head. He's aiming for Aaron now. Hand over your spinal fluid. He's about to fire, oh! 
Oh, who is that? Someone's just come up from behind and they just fired the Thunder Spear. I think it might be Armin or someone. They just fired a Thunder Spear right into the cannon. It's Armin. He's come up. Boom! He's fired the Thunder Spear right into the cannon and blown it up. A little longer and it would have been too late. He's just... Armin's just saved her, Eren's life. So Mikasa just saved Armin and Armin just saved her, Eren's life there. Shoot him down and the Marlene shoot, so, soldiers are trying to shoot her. Mikasa who comes up towards them and she just slices right into them. Fast with the speed that she has, boom. No, actually... I'm trying to think... I'm thinking they're aiming at Armin. Yeah, they're aiming at Armin because he's got the Thunder Spear. And I think Mikasa just sort of came backwards like that. And just slashed them, slashed them like that. Like that, like, because you can kind of see the smoke coming from, from, from this angle back forward and not back. So I think she just propelled herself backwards like that and killed the two soldiers through by cutting their heads off or their necks. So yeah, that's what it looks like. And she's landing and she's facing she's facing the cart titan now. It's over already. It's the yeah, Peckham's just like Stara, it's over for you already. It's the end for you. And uh Zeke's Titan is burning, it's it's evaporating now, so yeah, he's screwed. And Aaron sees this, and now we're cutting to Aaron in his time from watching, and behind him is, you know, is Reyna, and Falcon is just biting into that name, and there's the steam pouring out. Is it over? Aaron can no longer use the founding power. We accomplished our mission. It's okay if I let go now, right? I only have to undo the hardening of my name. Pass the armor Titan to Falcon. It will be the end for me. Gabby, if it's only Falcon, I can have him go back home. The only one to inherit the armor will be Falcom, so Reyna's ready to let... Yep, he's ready to let himself... Looks like Reyna's about to let himself die, man. No, no, he's not... No, shit. He, he's just on the Harding away, and... Uh, Falcom's going for it. Oh, God, Falcom looks ugly, man. Look at him, he's ready... He's like a freaking chicken, like, giraffe. Like, like buying down like that, like, oh, God. But there's someone... Someone's just... Someone's there now, watching them. And Rainer's lost his leg, like, he has no leg there. Rainer senses something, looks, and it's, 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 it's Galliard, man. Galliard's come out of his Titan form, and half his face is missing, man. Like, the whole part of his face is missing, and it's regenerated. I've used up, I've used up all the power to heal my body. However, I won't drop dead for nothing. Fuck. Oh god, Fal Falcom's just turned towards P P Porco, and Reyna's screaming, Porco! Porco, I saw my brother's memories, how he deceived the army and made you a warrior to protect me. This way I made it crystal clear, right? That until the end I'll always be better. Oh man, and Falco just, Falco just jumped and swept him up, man, like a freaking bird of prey, like a raptor, man. I, there's Falco being swallowed up. Oh man, the Jaw Titan is dead. Now, Falco just ate him. Shit, man. Porco, get, man. Porco sacrificed himself to save Raider, man, like his brother did. Oh god. A lot of people predicted that that might happen. Like, poor, like Raider would about, would commit suicide, but then Polka would come in last minute and be like, nope, and give his life to save him. So it's like it all comes full circle, man. Like, like Marcel saved Reyna, and Reyna saved Porco from Eren, and now Porco's saving Reyna and Falcom, technically, so... Shit, man, I mean, and Gabby's just like, kind of crying. Was that Galliard, son? Did he do it to save Falco? And he's just, oh, he just chewed on him, and Reyna's pissed now. Oh, oh, he's pissed, uh, and he's, he's smashing, he's just smashed into Eren, he's pissed. And Eren's just like, oh, he's hardened, he's hardened, he's, he's grabbed uh, one of Reyna's arms, and he's hardened. And while the other fist is inside, inside a uh, Aaron's Titan jaw, he's hardened that as well. So I think he's trapped him in there now, hardening. Yeah, he can't get out now because he's like, like trapped in there. Shit! Oh god! And Aaron's just burst out from the Titan. He's burst out from his Titan. He's come out while it's high, and he's bursting out, and he's, he's making a run for it. Well, Raider's trapped. He can't get him. And Raider's like, no way. And there's Zeke. Zeke's come out of his Titan, and it's all skeletons now. And there's Zeke. He's crawling. He's crawling towards Eren, and Eren's running towards Zeke. Shit! They're about to touch hands, man. They're about to touch hands. You understood well. Imitating Pe Peckham Chan and pretending to be dead was a success. Just a little bit more now. Eren. Eren's running for him. He's running. Ah, shit. 
uh, Rain has just broken free from the hot from Aaron's hardening and oh he's coming for him he's reaching out to grab him Aaron and Aaron, Zeke shouting Rain is shouting Aaron's like freaking roaring and boom a, a, a missile one of the spears just hit uh, Rainer's hand and one, another one hit his face and it explodes boom Rain, Rain is, uh, Aaron's looking up and there's Connie and Jean doing that she, and Rain has collapsed Aaron come here Oh man, Zeke looks bad. He's reaching out. There's Aaron running, and oh shit, uh, Aaron's running past her cult body, and there's Gabby with the sniper, with that big ass sniper rifle. And he sees her, and she's looking at him, and she's reload. Connie and Jean see this. Yeah, I, I don't know who, who's this looking. I think it's Peckham. She's too busy looking at her, uh, trying to fight in her arm in a Mikasa. The 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 the, the thing. Yeah, the cannon is gone now from her back because I've got her blades out and Armin's still got one thunder spear left. Armin and Mikasa are going for the kill and meanwhile uh, uh, Gabby shoots, she shoots. Oh shit, she, she shot Eren as he's reaching out. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Uh, what the fuck. A bullet of determination pierced through the little brother. Zika shot guys. Gabby just shot. She's losing that big ass anti tank rifle, right? You know what kind of damage those kind of fucking guns do. Like, she just shot through Aaron's neck. And his head's just be blown off. Like, his head's going flying. And Zeke is just horrified. Holy shit. Uh, I think Gabby just killed Aaron. Uh, unless, unless Aaron has just pulled a Rainer and transferred his consciousness to his spine before the bullet hit, then uh, oh, or maybe, perhaps, maybe this is a fake body because uh, if you look at the clothes, uh, remember Aaron? Aaron got his uh, leg a bit bitten off by by Galliard. He got his legs bit bitten off. And yet he's got his pants on and his shoes and pants are intact. So either that's an, uh, an editing mistake or that's that's not Aaron that ran out of the hardening titan. Unless unless uh, the ability of the Warhammer titan is that he can refix his clothes or something. But uh, either either that's a fake body or he's transferred his nerves to his spine or and that's an editing mistake or Aaron Aaron's just been killed. Uh, holy shit! Holy shit! Uh, damn. So that's chapter 119, uh, people. Uh, a great start to uh, volume 30. Things are getting intense. We've, we've, honestly, this is like a major. This is like a. This is like, this is like the final of a uh, Game of Thrones episode five, where they just decided to kill characters left and right. Except it, it was done better, and you know it was expected that this shit would happen. Like after what happened last chapter, we all knew. Zeke was gonna do that raw and transform certain uh, people that drank the wine. So yeah, uh, we got. Uh, I, I assume Neil and Pixus and all the other soldiers that 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 drank the fluid are pretty much dead now, and that's it. They're gone. Unless there's some way to transform them back. I'm fi I think they're done. Uh, we lost Colt. He got burned to death by by Falco. Uh, poor bastard. Trying to he tried to get sympathy from Zeke, but Zeke man, he doesn't really care. He wants all the Adalians and everything to die. Like he's not here to save them. He's here to kill. He's here to kill them, determine them, to extinguish them, technically speaking. So yeah, yeah. he's not, not gonna let uh, he's a uh, you know whatever relationship he had, he had with Cole, he's not gonna let that get in the way. So yeah, he sacrificed them and shit. And uh, Falcom ended up eating poor Pollock, man. And Pollock ended up doing the same thing Marcel did. Still trying to be the best. Still trying to be like. That's so sad, man. We never even got a moment with him and. Uh, I I'm so, I I I'm, I'm, yeah, I I imagine that Falco is gonna meet Historia, like like he's gonna end up going to that farm to that village maybe. I mean his family I assume is still alive, but I think he might meet her and maybe Historia through through Falco is gonna see Yamir's final moments or memories perhaps. So I'm thinking we're still gonna get something like that, but it's gonna be between them two and not uh, Polko and Historia like like we theorized. Polko's role is done, you know, Galliot's done, he's gone, he's dead, and Falco is now the uh, dual titan. Uh, Gabby just straight up uh, decapitated Eren, so damn.
and Mikasa and Armin were just busy about to deliver properly the final blow to Peckham, so I assume she's not going to last long. I, I'm, honestly, I don't know what's going to happen next chapter, I'm, uh, unless it decides to flash back and we start to see Eren's uh, reasons for what he was doing, because we still don't know what he was up to, unless we get his POV, and if he's dead, then damn, uh, I don't know what's going to happen next, but... Uh, uh, I don't know, man. Uh, what, if, if they eat Eren's body, will, will will someone get the founding titan abilities in there? Like, Jesus, man. Like, Isayama subverting our expectations in the best way possible. In the most unexpected way possible. But in ways that make sense. Unlike Game of Bloody Thrones Season 8. Oh, I'm never going to get over that. But, god damn. Uh, god damn. Uh, damn. Uh. So, Jean and Connie are aware of what just happened. Mikasa and Armin, I don't think they're aware what happened enough busy fighting the Cart Titan, so something's gonna have to happen there. Um, and Zeke's just horrified, so I don't know what's gonna happen next. But yeah, we're definitely entering the, the end game for this. Things are going a lot faster than I anticipated. So maybe, just maybe, this series will, eight, will end in, in seven chapters instead of eleven now. So, uh, I don't know, it, it, it could be possible because... This just happened. I mean, I don't know how much more this final battle can go on. Do you know what I mean? Like, like how much more is left in this fight? Like, how much more can they do? Like, we still haven't seen the, uh, we still don't know what's happened to Levi and Hunchy. Like, those guys, they need to come back somehow. Annie is still in the crystal, so we still don't know if she's going to be some sort of major player by the end game or not. I mean, it's been years now, but like, come on, Lisa, if you're going to use Annie now at this point, you might as well do it now. Do you know what I mean? Like, um... Uh, the, the 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 clan the the Asian clan like they've got a role to play and that bloody plane that they made the sea stone and that so that that has to come into play somehow uh, uh, pff, like what's gonna happen with that so a lot a lot of a lot of things that are still that still aren't been uh, that has, that still don't have resolutions yet but uh, yeah this was a this was a pretty cool uh, action emotional chapter this one so I'm 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 just like freaking hyped for next month man and. Yeah, it's pretty crazy we got this chapter at this point in time, like, it's it's the 4th, it's the 4th of July, and ironically enough, exactly one month from now, it's going to be my birthday, so I'm going to be 29 in one month's time. Uh, that's going to be a good present if, if the next chapter comes around out, around then. Uh, but yeah, shit man, what a chapter, what a chapter. Anyway guys, I hope you liked my reaction to that, sorry for the late upload for the previous, because um, if I haven't, if I... I don't know if I've uploaded or not, but if I have uploaded the previous chapter by now, cool. If I haven't, then I apologize. Like, I've just been so busy with stuff. But anyway, I hope you like this. And as always, like and subscribe, whatever. And I shall see you when I shall see you. Take care and bye, guys.